Okay, guys. I have a little bit of a nuisance call here on this Linux gas furnace. This is actually a friend of mine's house. I came out the other day. He had it on heat. And we weren't getting a call from the thermostat. So I jumped it and it came right on. He had one of those Pro One thermostats. I actually tapped on it and the furnace came on. So I said, well, you got a bad step. And he's like, well, that's fine because I want a Wi-Fi thermostat anyway. So we put him a T6 Honeywell Wi-Fi thermostat. And he said the heat is still not working. So I've got to see if we got a code on that board. And we don't. Same thing as the other day. We're not getting a code or nothing. Okay, I'm going to make a phone call to see if the thermostat is out of the way. Alright, so what I did is I jumped the, uh, I jumped the door switch out because I couldn't find anything to hold it in, so I just jumped it with a jumper. My wife is with me. This is a friend of mine's house, friend of ours. We're friends with the husband and the wife. And uh, we grew up with them, but they moved to the Lafayette area like we did. They hated Alexandria just like we did. Um, I am waiting. She's going to call me when the thermostat stops blinking. Heat on, it's in delay. And we're going to see if we're getting a call for 24 volts. If not, we may have to change the heat color. Might have a bad wire or something. I mean, it's wrapped around up there and then runs down, but we'll see what happens. I'm just waiting on her to call me to tell me that uh, it's out of delay. Well, gentlemen and a few ladies that do watch, this one was my fault. My white wire, you know, those new Honeywell T-Series thermostats, they don't, you don't screw the wires on, you just push them in. I didn't have the white wire pushed in good enough, and it wasn't making a good connection. Took it out, jumped it down at the thermostat, the furnace came on, and there's the blower coming on. And, uh... Jumped it at the thermostat, everything came on, remade the connection on the white wire, and here she is running. So this was my fault. Hey, we all make mistakes, nobody's perfect. I've done that a couple times on those T-Series thermostats. I've got to do a better job of pushing them in, making sure they make a good connection. Remember the past summer he had complained about low airflow in some of the bedrooms and I noticed that this is a four speed motor and they had a brown wire on cool. I, it said C blower speed chart but uh, I couldn't find the blower speed chart so I put the uh, blower motor on high speed for cooling. Uh, my wife turned it on cooling. It's in delay. I just want to make sure that I hear the refrigerant flowing into that ADP coil and the blower comes on and then we're going to test the heat again. So this was done by uh, one of the big hat companies here. You can see they hang the furnaces with strapping and uh, the pans are hung like that. All the, duct, all the ducting comes off the top of the plenum. They do have a built-in, they do this on all their plenums, a built-in uh, media filter. And it's a stamp grill in the house, so they have to use this filter. Which, that doesn't bother me because that keeps the equipment clean. So, I'm not going to put this top cover back on until... Because I want to check the heat again. <laughs> 